Hola amigos, it's Will here at Will's Custom Figures coming at you today with a big bad breakdown of the weasel suit, Bobby the Brain Heenan. So please guys sit back and relax while I talk you through why and how I made this guy and everything else in between. So firstly, why is it so important? I'll just put that in there so you can have a bit of a size comparison against some of the other figures that I've put up on my page recently. So... Bobby the Brain Heenan, all-time legend, one of the most dastardly evil villains in all of professional wrestling. I have already done a video on this guy, so I'm not going to go into too much detail. But during my childhood in WCW, in the um, you know all, all the different factions, his classic stuff in the WWF that he did, looking at his time as a referee, as a manager, everything else, this guy absolutely captured the imagination, and uh, for me, captured the. Um, I, I guess that's sort of the naughtiness, the, the comedy within professional wrestling, but while still maintaining a, uh, a level of um, a level of authenticity and uh, realism. So Bobby the Brain Heenan is uh, does have a special place in my heart. Now this weasel suit was from a weasel suit match that he took place in. There will be a tale added to this eventually, so I'll be sure to add pictures on there um, when. Uh, when that tail has been added so you guys can see. Uh, the tail's gonna take a little bit of work, but I just wanted to uh, show you guys where I'm at with it. I think the, the detail in the face is absolutely brilliant. I always use a bit of a varnish gloss um, at various points on the hair, just to give it a bit of a, you know, look like, he, like he's maybe running his hands through his hair or he's a bit sweaty uh, over the lips and over the eyes as well. I've also done all of the claws, which I've used um, uh, matchsticks, uh, not matchsticks, um, sorry, uh, toothpicks for, and um, the whole body was a big boss man originally, and I've uh, used clay to cover up his uh, his neck on the uh, on the figure, as you can see inside the V, and then I've used uh, clay to go around the entire body from top to toe, scoring as I go, trying to make sure that there's no parts left untouched. Um, there is still articulation in um, this arm and in this arm because it's fully painted. I'm not going to move him too much until he gets to his home with my good friend David who requested me to work on this commission. And guys, that's it. That is a big bad breakdown of Bobby the Brain Heenan in his weasel suit. Please, guys, like, comment, subscribe. Let me know in the comment section below. If you want one of these in your collection, feel free to reach out. And uh, if you don't, and if you just want to make your own one, I'm also here to, to give you some advice on you know, what to do, how to paint it, and all these other little details. So um, I love hearing from you guys. Let me know what you think of this video. And um, it's been a pleasure working on this one, my final reflections on Bobby the Brain Heenan. So from myself, from Bobby the Brain Heenan, it has been my pleasure getting to spend some time with you guys today. And I hope you've enjoyed this video. Peace.